TVS Motor Company, a reputed manufacturer of two-wheelers and three-wheelers globally, Wednesday announced its foray into the premium lifestyle segment with the launch of the industry's first modern retro motorcycle, TVS Ronin. Design ground up, the TVS Ronin is a lifestyle statement that takes inspiration from the modern new age rider. The TVS Ronin is designed with the style, technology and riding experience to promote an unscripted lifestyle. TVS Motor Company Wednesday announced its foray into the premium lifestyle segment. It launched the industry's first modern retro motorcycle, TVS Ronin. In the global motorcycle industry, with a motorcycle that we all hope uh, will celebrate a new breed of riders. And I'm sure when you see the bike in flesh, you're really, really going to say, yes, there's something different from TVS. Yet another prop from TVS. So, you know, as a company, we are an engineering company, we are a global company, we do a lot of research before we venture into something. Something we did in 2005 with bringing racing to the forefront, which was democratizing racing in India. And you know what Apache has done over a period of time. When we are studying the consumers in the market, we saw there are two broader worlds where the consumers today are slotted in. Either a world which is showman, flashy and performance driven. Second, which is elemental, rigid and heritage. And research showed us the new age rider is more spontaneous. He doesn't want to be bucketed in something. He doesn't want to say, hey, he's classic, this is for you. He wanted to get into something which he believed in in for himself, which is different. And we decided thereby to create a third dimension to the pre-existing two genres which are there in the motorcycling world. So what do we call them? Before I give the name to them, as we saw in the research and the study with the consumers, we are seeing a cultural shift. Whether you saw in pandemic times, you saw before that, there is a great shift which is happening in the culture of the country in terms of the whole motorcycling fight family. The cultural shift is happening, roles are evolving. You could see, you know, from providing something to becoming a partner. You know, physical supremacy, which was supposed to be so-called machism of motorcycling in the world before, to becoming an emotionally bringing that equality over there, goal post to the journey. Features of the bike, salient features of the bike in brief. Yeah. So I'll tell you, this is the industry first uh, modern retro, uh, which TVS has launched on the 225cc platform. So this is, bike as we said is a completely new brand, which is TVS uh, Ronin. So it's a modern retro motorcycle which we have launched today. And that is for the people, it's for those new set of riders who are looking for spontaneity, who are looking for a new kind of ride, who are looking for something different. They don't want to buy into something which is already available. And as I said, they don't want to be categorized either into a classic or a sports or a super sports category. They want something what they are and they want to get on a motorcycle which will define them. So that is where this bike is just very good. So it's loaded with a good uh, connected technology. So you've got a smart connect, so you've got riding modes into it. Uh, you can have uh, riding modes to have a very enjoyable ride. Um, it's, it comes in six different colorways. It's a 225 cc motorcycle. So more about the riding comfort of this motorcycle. The, the stance that you get on the motorcycle is very straight. So you go longer distance uh, on the motorcycle without having any fatigue. And um, not only the motorcycle which we have launched with, we have launched with a set of accessories and apparel, which is Ronin uh, specific. So we're seeing as a Ronin world on the aircraft. And with this product, we are really making our premium segment much stronger. They were very strong with uh, Apache. This will add up to the portfolio of uh, premium within the Apache, uh, within the offering from TVS. Who do you, uh, I mean, what are your uh, targeted uh, customers for this, the age group or of the audience that you come So, what, when we did the research, there a lot of people who want to buy for the first time, a lot of people who are already using the motorcycle, they were looking for something which is different. Uh, in the modern retro category, there are no motorcycles there, in this CC of uh, segment. And thereby, we are going to create this segment and grow this segment. And thereby, it will add to the volume of existing TV. So, it's not something which we have and we are growing from there. It is something what we are creating as a segment. I don't have the exact money that I can give it to you, but it is it's going to give a good mileage because it's on a 225 cc. There's a lot of uh, debate or rather uh, movement towards the e-bike uh, for the future. Uh, 
manufacture of e-bike. What are TVS uh, plans for the e-bike? So to be honest, now, today our focus is about this product. This is really a great, uh, great thing what we have done in the industry first. So there are a lot of consumers who would have seen the kind of the interest from the time we started uh, putting teasers was very, very high. And uh, consumers were looking for something which was different, which was not stereotype kind of a motorcycle. And this is something which will really help to grow that side. And in terms of other segments, you you know we are in other segment as well, but that is for some other day we'll have a chat. Sure, sure. But today is more about Ronin, more about the modern industry. And it's about that warrior who has no master. So, no known master. So, it's a, it's a really a very perfect motorcycle for you to ride. In city, off road, on board, it's a brilliant motorcycle. Bureau Report, Herald TV.